Hello everyone, this is Viren and welcome to the fantasy match preview for the game between Mumbai and KKR, two arch rivals. Now, before I get to the preview, yes, the fan to play leaderboard is now in its fourth phase. This is the last phase. So guys, jo bhi laziness hai, jo bhi hai, sab kuch chhod do, ja ke make 25 teams in every match because this is your one last chance to go to Australia and watch the T20 World Cup finals. It's an all expense paid trip for the top three winners. So leave all that laziness aside now, first three phases are done, this is your final chance. So make 25 teams right now for every game because you're going to anyway recover that money through the Grand Leagues. You're going to win a lot of prizes, there are a lot of cash prizes also like you can see above. So go make 25 teams now exclusively on the fan to play app. Now let's get to the preview. So first up, the keepers and the batters, I'm keeping it very simple in this section. It's not too complicated. Your one keeper is going to be Ishan Kishan. You don't have really a better option because Baba Indrajit has not scored any runs at all. So I don't know how we would be able to consider him in a small league team. Maybe in a grand league team because he's opening the batting. Apart from that, three batsmen, Rohit Sharma, he looked in really good touch in that last game. And he's going to play against his favourite opponent in this game. So I don't think there's an inkling of doubt of why you want to pick him. Similarly, Surya Kumar Yadav, ex-KKR man and along with that been in hot touch so becomes a really good choice. And the last pick is Shreya Sayyar, he's a Mumbai boy but at the same end he's the KKR captain too and he's by far looked like KKR's best batsman in this tournament till now. So I think they become really obvious batting choices. Now let's get to the main section with the all-rounders and the bowlers. So now we have the all-rounders and the bowler section. I'm going with two all-rounders from KKR and one from Mumbai. From KKR, I'm going with Andre Russell and Sunil Narayan. And they both will be my captain and vice-captain. We saw in the last game that KKR was missing the meat of their bowling in Omesh Yadav. And hence, Russell did bowl a few extra overs, caught you those wickets like he always does. And that big hitting was in full flow, too many six boundary points. So he's a really good and obvious captaincy choice. Similarly, Sunil Narayan is their most economical bowler across games, probably the most economical bowler in the tournament too. And apart from that, he's getting you that occasional wicket and hitting down the order, so a good vice-captain. Third bowler is Daniel Sams. He won Mumbai that last game in that last over, even though he didn't have too many to defend. And though he didn't take too many wickets, I think with the bat and the ball, he can give you a little bit of contribution in both departments and a 30-40 point contribution makes, us, makes him totally worth the pick. Apart from that, four bowlers in this game, Tim Saudi and Shivam Mavi from KKR. Now, Saudi has looked like a really good bowler for KKR, while Mavi has been in hot fielding positions, has been getting wickets, though has been quite expensive. So, will he be replaced? I don't know because they don't have too many other options sitting for them on the bench right now. In case he gets replaced, then you can just switch him out with maybe an Aaron Finch or an extra KKR batter. But for now, I'm going with this. Apart from that, the two Mumbai bowlers, pretty obvious, Riley Meredith, who's lost some pace of late, but he's been really sharp line and lengthwise, so a really good choice. And the last pick, the obvious one, Jaspreet Bumrah, he's not been getting you those regular wickets that we are used to seeing from him, but that's more so because the batting team has been trying to play him out rather than attack him. But when it comes to the worst and they have to attack him, then he's going to get you those wickets too. So now let's look at what our overall combination for the game looks like. Finally, the overall combination seems to have one keeper, three batsmen, three all-rounders and four bowlers. Now let's get to your favourite section, the matchup section. So two really interesting matchups in this game. First one is Rohit Sharma, who's been dismissed like eight odd times there by Sunil Narayan and that strike rate is hovering around 100, which means that Narayan does have the wood over him. Can Rohit just play him out and make do with the rest of the bowlers? Surely he can. Other matchup is Andre Russell been dismissed twice by Bumrah, but there that strike rate is 130-140. So there that will be like the battle of sparks where either one is going to win. So two exciting matchups and maybe a GL drop for you there too. So let's see what the challenge picks are now. So with the challenge picks, you can make your team with just two, three or four players. Currently, I'm going with three players in my team, Russell, Narayan and Rohit Sharma. All three of them really decent picks and give you value in multiple departments. So you two go make your picks now and keep in mind that you join us on the Telegram channel for your final team, second innings updates and lots more. All the good luck to you.